It is a direct consequence of the coronavirus pandemic that you perhaps haven't given a lot of thought to yet. It's what it might do to Canada's blood supply. Canadian Blood Services has been recording they've seen more and more cancellations of donation appointments and they are concerned about a shortage. So that story this morning, we bring you with Megan Fitzpatrick, who's outside a clinic in Toronto, noticing, Megan, that if you go to the Canadian Blood Services website, there is a great big message from the boss, the man who runs a CBS, that it is safe to donate during COVID-19. That's a message they want to share today. Yeah, they're trying to get that message out in the wake of this uh, significant increase, they're calling it, in cancellations of booked appointments in the last few weeks, Heather. And they are saying that this is worrying. They're saying that it's a warning sign that there could be potential challenges in the days and weeks ahead to maintaining Canada's blood inventory. And so they are trying to put this message out there publicly of reassurance. Let's take a look at part of a statement we have from Canadian Blood Services. They're saying, we want to reassure the public that our clinics are safe. We are adhering to the guidance of subject matter experts and federal and provincial agencies. And Canadian Blood Service is saying that their uh, screening protocols for potential donors, the cleaning of their clinics, that was all already very robust before the pandemic. And they're saying they're now taking even more measures to keep donors safe while they are in the clinics. So for example, you might not see donors lined up exactly side by side in those chairs like you normally would. They'll be spaced out more in the clinics, limiting the number of people in the clinics at a time. So they're saying that they're taking additional measures and also just trying to um, emphasize that the need for blood is ongoing. Uh, cancer patients, for example, use uh, blood donations, trauma victims, sometimes when there's complications in childbirth, blood is needed for the mothers. So uh, they're really trying to encourage people, Heather, to book appointments and to keep their booked appointments in the days and weeks ahead. There's lots of information, as you mentioned, on their website about blood donation. Perhaps people haven't done it before and so they want to uh, learn more about uh, what they might experience if they do come to a donor clinic like this one here in Toronto. Uh, and again, people can book appointments online or by calling Canadian Blood Services. So that is the message that they're trying to spread. They even had some help from Prime Minister Justin Trudeau last week in spreading that message, Heather. He was encouraging Canadians not to forget about the need to donate blood. Megan, thank you very much. Appreciate that.